Alright, welcome back to more Oxen for in the last video we found out just how bad I am at looking for stuff in a short amount of time. And go figure. Clarissa still gone. <laughs> she, she shows up and then she disappears. Although now the group and I seem to be on the same uh wavelength that we we need to find out and get ourselves unaffected? You want to see if it'll start? Uh, not really. Lame! I do. Who cares what you want? It's all about what I want. You wanna know why? Because I'm Alex! I get what I want. No, seriously, I, I, I am Alex. I, I get what I want, but I have no idea what I'm doing. And you didn't write what was supposed, where we're supposed to go. Well, that's great. Um, awesome. So, I'm like a sitting duck with its head cut off, I guess. Can I go down here? No. 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 Won't let me. Whatever. I didn't want to go down there anyway. So... We have quite a bit of everybody with us. I mean, we got... Really? Did it just now take you losers? Why can't I leave? I want to leave. What the hell? Just let me leave. Oh my god. Why won't... Why? Why can't I? Just let me, uh, escape a escapo. Just get me the hell out of here. Be careful, that film's really flammable. Wouldn't want Smoke and Johnny to light the house on fire. Ha ha. But I want to project it. All right, there's already something in here. Experiments and findings of experienced phenomena, January 52. Awesome. Oh, man. If this turns out to be just prehistoric home videos... Yeah. I'm sure this is it's just... sweet. They're learning. Boo! S okay, all right, we get it. Okay, we're getting warmer, I think. So, if you look at the, like, lines or whatever, the bomb shelter should lead right into the cave. Just like from another angle. According to this, at least. Oh, so it does. Brilliant! Is it? Yeah, how do we get in? It's just like the cave wall, only steel or whatever bomb shelters are made out of. Oh, what? She knew about these things? Wow, that's crazy. It says that to fix a temporal tear, that's a mouthful, in the cave, we would need to transpose to the other side and tune into the source within itself. Okay, but we're not doing that, right? Good question. Yeah, that's... that's going a little above. Above and beyond. Well, I don't know what to tell you, but strap in, boys and girls, because we might have to, okay? If it's the only thing that will fix us. Yeah, but that's, like, scary. Well, something better work. Or we're boned. Or we're boned. Precisely. Oh, sorry, this is like... this looks like the end, but from the... from the wrong film thing. No, 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 wait. This is something I actually remember from that stupid radio tour thing because it, like, sounded so weird. It's called the call and response system. It unlocks the bomb shelter. This is showing us how to do it. See? It says when someone sends an emergency signal from the Capard station in the woods and the receiving station confirms it. It's like a connected response thing. All right, but come on, Nona. Do you honestly believe that the old equipment in either building will still work? It's... I don't know, but it's the only thing we have so far. And time's a-clicking. Alex and me will head through the woods, do the, um, call part, 
You and Ren can hang by the door to the bomb shelter and open it when it's ready. Wait, wait, I, um, I'm sorry, I kind of zoned out there for a second. What are we doing? Ren and Nona are team, um, Soaring Eagle, and you and I are awesome squad. Uh, I want that one. And we're splitting up to work on some old fangled machinery to open the bomb shelter, to get into the cave, to yada yada yada, save our lives or whatever. <clears throat> but why do we have to have such a lame name? All they right. get Soaring Free. Eagle and we're just and awesome squad? Wrong, please, don't tell me, I won't want to know. Same here. I don't want to know nothing. Like, Jonas, come on, buddy. You gave them Soaring Eagle? And us, Awesome Squad. Are you kidding me? That is such a lame name. Like, don't get me wrong. It's flattering that you think we're awesome and all, but... That's a te It's just, no. No, we can't... You're an idiot. You know what? This isn't the awesome squad. It's the amazing one with the idiot. That's what we are. We're the amazing and idiot. And I'm definitely not the idiot. Jonas, that that would be you. You're, you're the idiot. Oi, I said Epiphany Fields, dude. Come on now. Pumpkin. Yeah, I think I really need to work on her name, but because the amazing idiots wouldn't work, because that would imply we're both idiots. No. Alex, Alex. Okay, are you are you back to normal? I just saw, it, it, it was like a premonition, I think, and, and I know that sounds whatever, but this must be what it's like when people say they do that, because I kind of just saw Ren drowning. Okay, okay, just take it easy for a second. You went all red-eyed, like when we get possessed. I did? You stopped walking and started mumbling, and then your eyes lit up like little road flares. It only lasted like a minute, but we should hurry up and do this before the door on you opens any wider than but the thing with Ren, it was so real. It was like it, I was there with him. Maybe we should go back. But I'm sure he's fine, so let's finish what we started. I forget. Um, I think we... Yeah, we go back. We go this way. <laughs> no, look, it kind of made sense. Hey, guys. Uh... Wait, did I get the plan wrong? Because if I got it right... No, you didn't get it wrong. I saw... I saw Ren drowning in a... The only way to describe it is it was like a vision or something. What? Seriously? Alex got possessed for a minute there. And yes, it was scary, but it was just a hallucination triggered by ghosts rummaging around through her brain. No big deal. I mean, they're clearly fine. Look, Jonas, it was real, all right? As real as the other loops or any of the other hundred crazy things that have happened tonight. Don't say that! What am I supposed to do with this? It's not like I can really avoid drowning any more than I can normally do on a daily basis. You're on land, Ren. I don't think anything's gonna happen. But then, why would she... why would she have just this... Just be careful, alright? I don't know why I saw what I saw, but just keep on your toes, okay? Well, I am now, yeah. Okay, well, it's been fun catching up, kids. We'll go do our half of the fix the ghost problem equation now. <sighs> alright, well, uh, see you after. I just hope so. Don't say that! <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure we're supposed to go this way. Doesn't... Does it lead all the way back to the, uh, the comm tower? I'm pretty sure... It, I mean... I guess technically they both lead that way. But that's, uh, that's a bit... Disturbing. Oh, I was going to Fort Milner. Yeah, we don't want to do that. 
Um, we don't want to head to the calm tower either. Yes, we do want to head to the Tower of Woods, though. So, we're going to go through, like, another gauntlet of weird magic tricks thrown at us by the ghosts. Because I, I kind of feel like that's probably you know what's going to happen here. Doesn't your phone just have a clock? I checked mine, but ever since we've been jumping in and out of loops, or whatever we're calling them, it's been acting, I don't know, weird. It won't really give me the right time, or, like, work, really, at all. French fries with ice cream good weird, or, like, five nuts and one peanut kind of scary weird? Nah, uh, somewhere in between. It's no big deal, it's just acting like I dropped it or something. You think this tuning into the tear thing's gonna work? Like, really? It really doesn't matter if I think it's gonna work. It's sort of all we have, and we're running out of time. It is all we have, yeah. I just... I just wish I felt like the ghosts were concerned that their plan won't work. I just feel like they're pretty confident. Like they know by sunrise they're all gonna be shopping for school supplies. Yeah, well, you know who else was confident? Hitler. And look how he ended up. Dead. With syphilis. Oh, <laughs> true. Wow. I think this um, stuff is getting pulled in from, like, their time or something. This is so weird. Um, yeah. It's not exactly a good omen. I think we're running out of runway here. Well, I mean, we only have one set predetermined path that we can walk down. Um. What's up with uh, the weird furniture here? I don't, I don't necessarily like that. Oh, wait. So you don't have to do that jump? Oh, you don't. You can just do the jump. That is awesome. All right, so, and this area should be where the catbird is, if I'm correct. It should be all the way up at the top. Because it has like the 60.4 or whatever. No. Pretty big girl princess. Yeah. Oh, pumpkin's just being so cute. Why do cats have to be so adorable? Explain to me, pumpkin. Why do cats have to be so adorable? I love how this let's play. This game's really intriguing, and yet I'm talking about my cat. <laughs> now the station's up at the top of the hill. <sighs> I hope this works. Oi, stop bringing bad juju into this. This is why you're the idiot of the group. Oi, where'd the chair go? No. No, seriously. Where, where, where was the chair there? Where'd it go? Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. <sighs> Ugh, not this again. We're in another time maze thing. Ugh, okay. We were due. It's been like a minute since the last one. Really? Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. Yep, I am also... hope that. <laughs> yes, I am also... hope that. Ren! Nona, what happened? What's wrong with Ren? Ren, he's... he had an accident. He... he died. I couldn't... No, no, come on. Clarissa was dead too, but like bunny ears dead, not dead dead. Because apparently killing yourself doesn't actually do anything here. Alex! Well, it's the truth, Jonas. And I'm not gonna stand here and fall for one of these I'm dead, no I'm not, shuffleboard swaps again. Come on, let's skip to the last chapter. I know what's gonna happen. He... he drowned. He took a fall. I don't know. He just... he just stopped. I mean, does it really matter what happened? Either way, done is done. Shut up, okay? Just 
Shut the hell up. I don't want to hear any more of your ghost garbage, all right? It isn't garbage, and we're not ghosts. Don't be rude. Alex, we know you're in charge, and we know your plan, and we also know that your plan won't work. It never does. So we have a proposition for you. A deal. A bargain, really. Who on earth would give you the idea that I'm in charge? It's been like herding puppies the entire night, making anyone do anything. Please drop the modesty. It's lying for no reason. It's already over for Clarissa. She's gone. We'll pilot her through the rest of existence, and there's nothing you can do to change that. But if you agree to let us take her, let her go quietly and without fuss. We won't slaughter the rest of your friends, like young Reginald here. We leave the rest of you cattle alone. We only really... I don't get it. Why do you even need my permission if you have her already? Don't misunderstand. We don't need anything from you except what we can willingly take. We're merely offering you an arrangement that would leave both parties satisfied. Well, somewhat satisfied. Your friend... Oh, what? This is weird. This is also the perfect time to end the episode. <laughs> Although this probably isn't as good for the people who's probably seen this elsewhere but i don't care cliffhanger time baby hope you have a great day remember only you can be the best you can possibly be if you like the video give it a like comment if you like it super special awesome subscribe if you want it and really help me out and ta-ta for now it's not very pumpkin no don't want to speak all right ta-ta for now